Good evening once again and welcome back. It's time for devotional. Shall we go ahead and pray? Let's pray. Father in heaven, Lord God, Lord, we thank you and our hearts are filled with joy. Bless us now, you people, as we meditate upon your word. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. The title of tonight's devotional, Keep Watch, Keep the Faith, and Keep the Relationship. Matthew 25, 13. Therefore keep watch, because you do not know the day or the hour. The story of the ten virgins found in Matthew 25, 1 to 13 speaks about the faith of the ten virgins waiting for the coming of the groom. The kingdom of heaven will be like these ten virgins who took their lambs and went out to meet the bridegroom. Five of them were foolish and the other five were wise. The foolish ones took their lambs but did not take any oil with them. The wise ones, however, took oil in, the, in jars along with their lamps. With the lamps, the bridegroom took a long time to arrive, and they all became drowsy, tired, and fell asleep. Starting with the verse six, it says, "At midnight, the cry rang out: Here's the bridegroom! Come out to meet him!" Then all the virgins woke up and trimmed their lamp, lamps. The foolish ones said to the wise, Give us some of your oil. Our lamps are going out. The wise virgins replied, No, there may not be enough for both of us and you. Instead, go to those who sell oil and buy some for yourselves. But while they were on their way to buy the oil, the bridegroom arrived. The virgins who were ready went in with him to the wedding banquet, and the door was shut. Later, the others also came. Lord, Lord, have mercy upon us. They were keep knocking at the doors, asking, please come let us in. But you know what the Lord said? I do not know you. Apart from me, I do not know you. It is so sad because many of us, we thought that we're following Jesus. And then at the end of it, I'm sorry, I don't know you. But I Just this afternoon, I went to the beach thinking that I have my camera with me. I brought all the stuff thinking really in my mind that the camera is in the bag. When I arrived there, to my dismay, nothing. <laughs> nothing! I, I couldn't find the camera! I left it in the building and I have to walk again? I cannot do that. It's a long walk for me. So now, with the story of the ten virgins, it reflected in my mind. I said, it's like this too. In the journey towards heaven, we thought that we have it all. We're thinking that our, our lamp are full of that oil we need in our journey. But towards the end of the journey, we're running out. We're running out. We're running out. You see, when it comes to journey towards heaven, it's all about our relationship with Him. Jesus didn't recognize them when he came in. When they keep knocking on the door to let them come in, Jesus didn't recognize them. Maybe that will happen also in these last days when Jesus will come in the clouds of heaven to get us and be with him to realize that we're not part of the banquet. We're not part of the wedding banquet. This is a sad story. But if you're with the five wise virgins who prepared all the way from the beginning to the end until Jesus came in, in the story, we know that they were enjoying time together with the Lord. I hope that we choose the right thing because once you're there, 
in the end of the you know in the end of the journey with us here on earth no turning back whatever that you have that's it salvation is very highly individualized you cannot say nobody it's between you and the Lord it's between you and the Lord you cannot save your husband you cannot save your wife you cannot save your kid it's highly individualized it's about time to be awakened and we evaluate ourselves of our relationship with God where we are at this point where we're at this point so I hope that the blessing of the nice devotional will kind of like give an enlightenment in our hearts and our minds right now and just ask God Lord please have mercy have mercy upon me oh God help me reconnect with you I want to spend eternity with you but how Lord please help me and the Lord will give you that peace or give you the desires of your heart in accordance with, to his divine will and his will is he wants you to be with him in heaven shall we go ahead and pray let's pray father in heaven our god thank you for the blessing of you of your word tonight may we always remember oh god to prepare ourselves as you are coming very soon oh god tighten the relationship with you and help us oh god to always remember your goodness the blessings and your promises Thank you so much for everything and for hearing and answering us. In the love of Jesus, we pray. Amen. All right. So I hope you guys have blessed for tonight's devotional. I will see you again tomorrow. God bless you. Bye-bye.